Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I'll be showing you guys how to do a color correction effect and also how to sharpen your video. And just to clarify, uh, these are, you pretty much, you need a plugin for these. Um, pretty much just the basics, BCC and Sapphire. And what you want to do with these is that you pretty much just use them at the end just to make your uh, highlight look even better. So first off, let's drag a clip in. All right. Maybe one of the newer clips I go. Let's take a look. All right, so let's say I want to use that clip, yeah. And as usual, I probably would just mark where the kill is in this case the kill comes here didn't finish him off as fast as i wish but it is what it is all right and i'm gonna cut it like i usually would and let's say i just edit it but like in this case i'm not going to since i'm making a video and then what i would do is i would first of all uh go to s uh i'm pretty sure it's bcc or search unsharp so yeah unsharp mask uh, and then pretty much what you would want to do is just copy the settings I put alright so for the radius you would want an 8.9 radius the amount 8.9 as well zero threshold output channels RGB reduce flicker off maximum original zero and then you should have your thing ready. All right, so let's just render that out. All right, and if we watch this back, it's, it, it just like feels like the character is slightly more outlined. See it? Compare that a bit. You can kind of see that the edges are just more uh, vibrant. And I'm more defined. A lot of good editors use this as fact as well. I think primarily Penguin and others use this, so yeah, that's really useful. And then, all right, so let's just search the metric color now. And what we want to do here is we just want to add a bit of a vignette to it. So maybe 10 and then maybe it or maybe, and then you can just play around with this. So you want to have like a negative amount and just add a bit of a uh, blackish amount to it. So I'm just gonna maybe set it to take a look. I think it's still a little too noticeable. I think one's okay. So this really depends on what you like. Okay, now that we're done with the lumetric color, we're gonna go to S underscore hue set bright. Right. Okay, now that we have the hue set bright, you're gonna put hue shift to 0 0.3. Or it depends what you want. You can go even deeper or slightly lighter. So it's all really depends on what how much you want to change it. So as you can see, like let's say I didn't do this. See the color. If you look at the gun, I think gun color or the sand color is the best to look. So it just makes it slightly warmer. And that's pretty much what you would or you could turn the brightness down a little as well. If you want to as well. But personally, I wouldn't do that. Saturation, if you want to, you can go 0.9 to make it look slightly more faded. And yeah, so that's pretty much how you do the color correction and the shark pin. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, this is just a really quick one. And uh, I think these are really helpful in showing you guys how to uh, like pretty much just touch up your um, highlight in the end and make it look a lot better. And uh, if you guys enjoyed this, please like and sub. I'm nearly 1k subs, and helping me hit that goal would be really great. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one, and peace out.